Hello, this is Eric at the Prince Road Ford Pre-Owned Supercenter, and we're taking a look at the 2011 Hyundai Tucson in an L trim, I believe, and powered by a 2-liter engine, providing you with excellent fuel efficiency, and recently detailed, so it's looking nice and clean, but let's take a look inside. So first, taking a look into the back, where you have a decent amount of space that can always be expanded by folding down the rear seats, and of course, under this hatch here, you have your spare tire compartment with a ton of extra room around it, if you want to put stuff in there. Then you do also have a 12-volt power outlet right there and now looking at the back seat where you have seating for three pretty comfortably with a fold-out armrest with two cup holders in the middle and then you do have hard plastic back seats so you're not going to feel your back passengers knees in your back and now looking at the front where you have power windows power mirrors and power locks now sitting in the vehicle with it running you can see it's sitting at uh, 133,723 kilometers and uh, then to the left of that you have your little trip button where you can cycle through your information such as your distance to empty, your fuel economy, your average speed, your trip timer, your eco, trip mileage, you only have one not A and B or one and two, uh, but then moving on to your center, your infotainment center which is radio, CD, auxiliary, USB, and I believe that is it, but you do have quite a few options there for whatever you want to listen to, however you want to listen to it. Just below your screen you have your traction control shutoff, hazards, and your uh, hill park button, I believe. I'm, I'm not 100% on that. Uh, moving down from that you have your climate controls here, pretty simple, easy to do, or easy to use. To the left of that you have your heated rear windshield, so you can defrost that. In the colder months and then uh, moving down from that down here you have this cubby with uh, let's see two 12 volts I believe and two USBs or no one USB and auxiliary so you can either plug something into power or charge from there or just hook up your audio that way and then you have your main shifter here with select shift down here so you can manually shift through your gears two cup holders and your center compartment slash armrest here which is relatively empty inside, but that just means it has plenty of space for all of your stuff that you want to cram in there. But that should cover our look at the interior. So now if you're interested, feel free to give us a call at 250-563-8111 or just come on down to the dealership and have a look for yourself and have a nice day.